it it's pretty simple to use so let me show you on the settings part it's quite easy here you add your let's say uh, your website I'm going to use going to use buildmyincomedaily.com uh, the referral URL for those uh, who actually don't know what it is uh, it's like um, it tells analytics soft analytics services like Google Analytics from where your visitors came to your website so let's say that at some point uh, you, you can add unlimited lists unlimited websites uh, as many as you want and I'm going to add to refers okay uh, let's say that at some point one visitor will come from google.com and another visitor will came from uh, facebook.com user browsers uh, it's uh, it's it's the user browser that a visitor will use on your website. It, this makes the visit to be unique. Besides that, the visitor will have uh, will come from a different website that you can set up here. We'll also use a different browser. Okay. The uh, element I did. I'm come. I will come to this part when I will show you the the social exchange. Uh, the beauty of the system is that you can actually decide the minimum time uh, someone stays on your website. Most of the exchanges uses the uh, a maximum time or let's say a fixed amount of time uh, to get a visit on your website. In an exchange here you can set up a minimum uh, a minimum time. Let's say that we want a visitor to uh, stay a minimum of uh, 15 seconds and uh, maximum time of 45 seconds. What happens is that all visitors will uh, visit your website for a minimum time set as a random, uh, as a random value, uh, a random value in the, in and 45 and 45. And giving myself and some giving echo, myself in the background. Some echo in the background. Marvin, that's your phone. Marvin, that's your phone. Uh, no, that's not me. Okay. And okay. Uh, uh, rewards. Uh, rewards. Here you can set up a Here price. Set up a price. Like, uh, like how many credits how much credit do you want to give as a reward for your visitors to share your uh, website your link your ad uh, let's say we want to share uh, we want to offer uh, it's up to 99 credits we want to offer for 30 credits uh, to our visitors you can bake up your entire settings and every time the software opens, it will get uh, loaded automatically back into the software. So you don't have to copy paste anything. At this moment, the exchange is active. By default, uh, your websites are shared inside the system. If you, let's say you want to deactivate this, if you uh, check the security box, and click on the button it will disable the exchange completely what this means is that you can still uh, visit other websites just in case you don't have any other any website that, uh, or any offer at this moment to uh, offer or to get uh, visitors to it so you want to disable the exchange you can disable the exchange but you are still able to visit other members uh, in the, inside the system. Consider this, uh, guys. You can. Uh, it's easy to consider the exchange as 
the telemarketing on the on the television uh, program. On the late nights, they keep showing you some ads, some useless stuff, and keep stuff like that. Well, basically, the exchange is built on the same idea, just that it's more fun and it's more direct. This is why we call it direct advertising exchange because it's, uh, you you can visit a website, uh, but at the same time. You, for only one visit, you can receive, let's say, up to 60 visits to your website. What is, is this true? Some people said it's not possible, but yes, it is possible. The exchange ratio is 1 to up to 60 for the pro members, 1 to up to 30 for the light member. Yes, it is possible. Let's say you visit a website. As a pro member, you visit a website for, uh, you can set it, set it up up to 600 seconds, up to 10 minutes, okay? So let's say you visit someone's website for uh, 10 minutes. Yeah, there, there, there are members. I, I did visit websites for up to 10 minutes. So, okay, uh, because you are a pro member and you did the, the visit manually, it's not automatic visit you get the 100% uh, time, so I get 600 seconds. But on the other on the other side, I want to receive, uh, I want to set up a 10 second minimum time on my website. This automatically pushes your uh, your website uh, to 60 visitors. So it's true, it's one uh, one to 60 ratio. Okay, so let's activate this again. Now it's active. I'll set it up to 35, 15. So all my visitors will visit my website for a time between, a minimum time between 15 and 35. And they will be rewarded 30 credits for each uh, social share and the gift, which I didn't set up right now, or if they open the website in their default uh, default browser. Okay, I'm going to leave this as is. Accounts, this is for social accounts. At this point, there are seven uh, social exchanges. YouTube is not set up yet because uh, there will be some some other uh, interesting stuff inside it, not just sharing. We want to add a thumbs up and comments inside Facebook, just uh, to be on the good side of, you, uh, of YouTube. Sorry, not Facebook. I have to restore my account. Okay. And yeah, actually I deleted my password for a video tutorial. So let's see if I can log in. I'm going to do just these two for uh, just to show you how exactly it works. Okay, I'm logging in in Facebook, now I'm logging in, in Google+. Plus. This, windows can be, uh, this window can be closed uh, because the software will automatically tell you if you are logged in or not. So we are logged in inside Facebook and Google+. Plus. Okay, now for, uh, because I am logged in inside Facebook and Google+, Plus, on which uh, on each website that I will visit, uh, these two buttons will show me the rewards, the, the price, the credit that the, that member actually wants to reward me if I'm going to share his website on my timeline and also in my uh, Google Plus timeline. The manual views as a pro member, manual views offers 100%. Uh, time back to me 
So if I'm visiting, let's say, right now I will visit the website, which is this link, for 34, 35 seconds. Because I'm in the manual view, because it is actually a real visit, I will be rewarded 100% of the time, which would be 35 seconds will go into my time. And one bonus credit. Each manual view rewards one bonus credit to the members. This member doesn't want me to share because I don't see any uh, any rewards on my Facebook and Google Plus. I don't see any gift. He didn't set up any gift ID, and I also I don't see any open uh, reward. Okay. Yeah, it's a game. Nice. So we go back again. 628. Well, actually, here it is. There's a member who wants me to reward me 35, 33 credits uh, for the, uh, the exchanges. And I will get 16 credits for the, if I open his website in my default browser. This button allows, allows me to open the website in the default browser. What happens? Uh, none, none of these are actually uh, allowed to be used until the times uh, go out. So I have to wait. Actually, I have to visit the website to get the to get the uh, to be allowed to share or use any other or any gift to receive credit. You can, uh, if you don't like a website, you can block it. Once a website is blocked, none of that member websites will get into your browser anymore. Uh, the uh, reset time is to 24 hours. So let's say you don't like a website, you can block it. That members will never, uh, for the 24 hours time, we won't show you any more websites. You can skip a website if you want. Careful, if you skip a website, you will not receive any credits or time. It will automatically cancel all your previous work that you do. And of course, the auto show feature that allows up to 50% time. No credits, no gifts, no, because it will be against the other the other members policies uh, I know it would be against your own uh, websites let's say you won't want uh, to offer 100% of other members just to generate uh, it's not fake traffic because fake traffic it's actually proxy traffic fake hit it's still uh, real traffic it still runs in uh, upon your rules because you guys uh, control everything. Imagine that right now I'm visiting this website for uh, the minimum time that is set up for me. I'm visiting with the user browser, uh, with the user agent, the browser that is, uh, is sent to me. Uh, it's everything under your control. If you want uh, a member to visit the website for a minimum 10 seconds with the Chrome browser, then all your members will will have to obey your your rules. That's the that's the beauty of the entire exchange, and that's the power. Uh, everything is, is is under your control because each website is randomly selected. Each Refer is randomly selected, and each uh, user agent is randomly selected for all members. There won't be, you won't have uh, two visits that will be identical. It's impossible, unless of course you just want to set up one website, one refer, and one user agent. Yeah, that's your choice. The element ID. Uh, allows you to, I mean, I don't know if many of you are familiar with uh, HTML elements. 
HTML elements allows you to set up an ID that ident identifies that element on the web page and it can be called by JavaScript or other type of script on your, on your browser. So this is what we call a GIF because uh, inside the exchange uh, ad block is not used. Uh, as you guys can see I'm actually using uh, ad block on my Chrome browser because this is allows me to faster load uh, the web pages so I don't have to wait for the ads okay so right here uh, you can set up uh, an element ID what happens let's say that you want to uh, add your AdSense banners inside the inside an element ID, inside a div, and give it uh, an ID of your choice that can be random. Okay, you just take this uh, element ID, add it inside, uh, inside your field. Right now it's disabled. We activated, this gets encrypted, and every time it's sent to a member, it will be accredited again and again and again to all members. This makes the system impossible to detect. Once you send uh, an ID, a gift ID to your members, to your visitors, their uh, software button will, will show up uh, the reward that you want to offer them. And when they click this button, it's like they actually will click the uh, sign, a sign up button can be inside, uh, a banner can be inside, uh, that's up to you to decide what you want members to actually click and do on your website. Well, this is more or less the startup uh, of the exchange. If you guys can still hear me, Kind of bad because I, I feel like I'm talking to myself. I don't know if, if someone can hear me. Okay. Uh, uh, any questions? You can write them down. <laughs> 